As part of the Dynamics 365 platform, Microsoft offer an app for mobile interfaces. This is actually designed on the unified interface and can actually be used on the desktop as well. Because of the unified interface, Microsoft deliver this across platform, iOS, Android, and Windows. And as you can see, it delivers some of the same visibility that you've got with a slightly different layout, including dashboards, the ability to see the entities in the system, and also similar views of records that you've got, as well as a few new features around how to filter. They also deliver reactive charts and give you the ability to view information in a tile view, which you can click on to drill down to the individual records. On the records themselves, there are a couple of different capabilities. It is designed specifically to be able to be seen mostly on a single screen, meaning that you have the tab interface. And as you can see here, by clicking on these titles, you can jump into the different sections of the record and also related records. They also deliver the timeline functionality, which gives you a breakdown of everything that's happening, including posts, activities, and notes in a single view. And also, when you come back to the record, we'll show you what's new since the last time you visit it. On the left-hand side of the screen, you can pop out a view so you don't have to jump back and forth between the view page to be able to scroll through the different records that you're working with. And you can quickly access forms that have more readable space because of the shrunken version of the process-driven form. These forms do still have all the functionality, but you do click on them to drop down the steps that you fill in as you go through the engagement. There are also, as you can see by the estimated revenue and probability, some different user interface capabilities to be able to drag with your finger on touch screens. With the light bulb down the bottom of the page, you can see that this activates on the right hand side the relationship assistant. The Relationship Assistant delivers machine learning functionality in Dynamics, and in this case, we'll show you leads that have no activity in recent times. You can set the time period, 30, 60, 90 days, that will pass this threshold, and any records that go over that threshold will then be added into the Relationship Assistant. This can also work with cases and opportunities that are coming up for close. Slightly over to the left, we have the task flows. Task flows give us the ability to use natural language to be able to design ways of updating the system. So as you can see here, follow up with opportunity after meeting and update contact. If we choose update contact, you'll go in and choose the individual that you want to update the information for. It will pull up the contact record, showing you all of the relevant fields that you want to generally update a contact with and also take you in to the account record where you may have additional information you want to add. This interface is designed to be used on both tablets and smartphones but does give you the ability to select using the unified interface between all of the basic hubs that are in Dynamics. The sales hub, the customer service hub, project resource hub and field resource hub all give you the ability to be able to have a fully functional dynamics out in the field with you and also has the ability to have online and offline availability.